Hello everyone, welcome back. Today we will see how to resolve the error web driver cannot be resolved to a type. It is very common error which we get while working with Selenium projects. So here we see this is a very simple Selenium program, very basic one. And if we mouse over on these errors, we'll see. We'll get two types of error. Here because we can see there is red one on two places. So let's see what's the error it is showing. See multiple markers at this line. Chrome driver cannot be resolved to a type and web driver cannot be resolved to a type. Here again we are getting this one. Why cannot be resolved? If you go here also, the import.org.openqa cannot be resolved. All these errors are coming because this, this is a simple Java program. If you see, this is a class error demo.java, right? This is a simple Java program. In the simple Java program, we are writing Selenium stuff. So we have not communicated the Java program that this is a Selenium project. So all this mess is happening because Java doesn't know that this is a selenium project so to tell that any java program we use some selenium jars which communicate with java program to behave uh, as a selenium program so here what we have to do is we have to configure some selenium jars so for that we'll go to google and we'll simple search selenium jars that's it nothing else see if we enter selenium jars the very first website comes as download selenium this is the official website of selenium if we go here latest table version is 4.1.2 <coughs> it can change also tomorrow if they release some other uh, new stable version always go with the stable version here if you scroll down you will see for different language different jar files are there for ruby you should take this one for c sharp this one and for python this one for javascript this one and for java this one so we'll click on this once we click on this this kind of uh, selenium zip file will be downloaded in our system so we'll go to our uh, location where we have saved this selenium java 4.1.2 compressed zip file this one we have to extract okay because uh, this is a java file this is a uh, compressed file zip file we have to extract it if we extract it it will be like this oh my god this latest version so many jar files are there so all these jar files are we have to configure in our java project and inside this lib folder also what and all jars are there we should so many jar files are there in this lib for this latest version these also these many jar files are also we have to configure in the jar in the java project i have one older version of jar files also i will show you this is 3.141.59 in this if you see only these two client combined and client combined sources and inside the lib only five jars are there <laughs> so total only seven jars were there in the previous version but in the latest latest version they have given so many jars 4.1.2 so let's work with this 4.1.2 always it's better to take the fresh and latest one so we'll go to our program if we see here we have to configure the jar file so here this error is coming because this error is coming for two reasons either jar files are not configured properly or wrong jar files are configured or jar files are not at all there so if you see here if you go jre system library it's completely java which comes default so if we see here there is no jar file so let's configure jar file and we'll see what happens if we configure 
wrong uh, wrong path if we configure jar files in a wrong manner so for this go to this project right click build path and go to configure build path here let's suppose we are taking it a and here library step should be selected don't go with order and export module dependencies projects and source go to libraries let's take this module path so here select this module path add external jars and take all 4.1.2 jar files now if only jar files are selected only remove is activated so again to configure that lib jar folders go this one add external jars inside this lib again so many jar files are there insert this apply close see the moment you imported all the jar files this error is gone but as we have configured the jar file at the project level not at the module level i still doubt if it's work let's see run this program unable to initialize main class error demo see it's not running see this is 4.1.2 jars that's why at least errors are gone initially initially when uh, this this 3.141.59 was there even if you configure on the project level that errors were not going but in this stable version they made some changes and at least error is going but program is not running so now let's do it in a correct manner till now we have uploaded the jar files on the project level but we should not configure the jar files on the project level for that now what we have to do first we should refactor configure build part we we have to unconfigure all this so select all these jar files lots of jar files are there in this worker so to remove this we should select all the jar files and remove apply <coughs> now what we have to do is we have to uh, configure all these jar files in the class path initially if you remember we were doing it a module path we should never do that we should always install the jar files under class path so go to class path add external jars select all the jar files see this is the these jar files is under the lib so we'll select all these now again we'll go to the class path again add external jars and this time outside the jar lib folder whatever jars are there we will configure all those open apply this is very very important part this is the reason why we were getting error we should never install the selenium jars under the module path we should always add the external jars inside the class path so apply we already did apply and close now see anyways error was already gone now we'll try to run this program and 
is you will see whether it is running or not see it is running thank you guys i hope you all will be able to resolve your this type casting error web driver cannot be resolved over type thank you thanks for watching this video